seeing collecting today. Picked up some crabs and some ragworm. So I'm going to stick out one rod with a pulley rig on it, crab, try for a smooth out. The other rod, I've got three of boom rig, weighted booms, see if I'm getting sold. So we've got a few crinkly crabs, I'm going to bait one up now. What I like to do is I like to leave a, a long tag in on my hook. So once I've wrapped the, uh, the crab up, I fold the tag in over the crab. So when I cast, it, the, the crab won't slide up the hook. It means I don't have to use a, uh, a panel rig, which I don't like doing with smooth hands, because you find the, the second hook can quite often get caught in the, uh, in the fish in their face, or when they're thrashing about, even hook yourself. So how I like to do it is... Straight down through, through the back, up. back legs up on itself Good. round the legs onto the iron hook a few times down the body then fold the tag in back down with that down the crab that's how I like to leave it Break the little legs off the end. I've just had my first fish. Only a little tiny bass. What's that? Eight inches long. Caught on the boom rig. So I've got my weighted booms. Weighted booms, little size two hooks. <laughs> that too far like 30 40 yards of that one just keep it in the air see if there's any soul knocking about just had my first smooth hand of the trip six pound on crab really happy with this one took me a little while well, it's been a quite a tough session for me today but I've had uh, two bass so far the one smooth hand, well, over the moon with a smooth hand. It took me quite a while to get one, I was uh, beginning to think I wasn't going to get one. I have a moment with that. Right, not long after getting that first one, managed the second one, which is about 10 minutes after. I think it's a little bit smaller than the last one, but I'm well pleased with that. It's turned out to be a good night so far. I hope you don't get a few more. The tide's turned now. We're in about an hour of the ebb. I think I've got two or three paid of crab left, so uh, we'll see how I get on with them and choose those to up there at the end of the session. But so far, two hours and two small bass. It's been, it's been a good trip, really, all in all. A bit slow, but I'll be over the moon with two small bands. I know I am. Maybe third one. They're getting smaller, but I'm not disappointed. I don't mind catching them when they're this big. I've got time for another another one yet, so I've still got two crabs left. So I once they're gone, that'll be the end of my trip. Maybe sold now. 37 centimetres, good size one that. It's a PB, my biggest one before this one was 36 centimetres. Two hook and a small piece of rag one. I'm gonna go and get him back now. Number four. 
every cast since I've had that first move out now, I've had another one, so that's four in a row. They've been getting smaller, but I don't mind. One more crab left, and it's time for it off. Another little small bass. Got my last crab on now, and I'll just about to use my last rag one, so that'll be the end of it. Hopefully, GoPro. That's it, finished now, back in the car, got to throw my crab and my rag. I uh, finished up with four smooth hounds, four bass and one sole. Uh, really, really pleased with that, got my target fish, so that was, that was a good, good session all in all.